This is the conservative czar. The health care bill looks like it's going to pass. The 2010 elections are going to be the most important elections in the history of this country. It is up to every single conservative to get involved in these elections. Now, you don't have to get deeply involved. But you need to pay attention. You need to be willing to support candidates. Now, first of all, paying attention. Every single one of you, every single person needs to pick a candidate, a congressional candidate, a candidate, a member of the House of Representatives to work for in this election. They need to be a conservative. They need to be, and, and, and let's get one thing straight here, absolutely straight. There's no such thing as a good Democrat. All Democrats are bad. We have, we, the proof is in what has just happened to us. They, 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 when push comes to shove, they are pro-abortion. When push comes to shove, they are poor, uh, 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 for big spending. They're for socialism. When push comes to shove, they are bad. Now, even, even people that you might know who are Democrat congressmen, they belong to it, who you think are good, they belong to an evil party. By the mere fact that they are a Democrat, they're bad. We have to accept that fact. Now, I'm not a big Republican at all. Only half the Republicans are tolerable. The other half aren't. But the party is, itself stands in stark contrast to the Democrats, and the health care bill proved it. Now, so you need to pick a candidate. You need to work, uh, so right now, we need to work within the Republican Party. Don't pick fights with okay Republicans. Now, we have good Republicans, okay Republicans, bad Republicans. Okay Republicans are people who vote with us most of the time. Don't pick a fight with these guys. Look around the area that you live in. There will be within 50 or 100 miles of where you live a bad Demo a Democrat, but bad by nature, or a bad Republican that you can work against. Get your nose to the ground. Find the candidate. And, and every single conservative should be doing this now. Now, you're not going to find a candidate right away, but put, get, put your nose to the ground. Look at your congressional district. This is all, this is all research. I'm not asking you to do anything. Now I'm going to talk about supporting that candidate. I, I don't care if you never walk a precinct, if you never lick an envelope, but I'll tell you what I want every single one of you to do. And we have to make up our minds right now. You must contribute to these candidates. You must take money, hard-earned money, and give it to them. Now, I know a whole bunch of you who are going to say, well, gee, I can't do that. I'm broke. Well, you just got through spending $500 on Christmas. And let me tell you something right now. This election is more important than a present for Christmas. This is about your grandchildren's future. You need to research, find a candidate, and you must be willing to give that candidate money. And that's the minimum every one of us can do.